Hello everyone, today I am going to showcase my witch farm. This is a fully automatic witch farm. Uh, it is fully automatic as in I have a witch quest right here and uh, it produces money such as that. So all I do is AFK here, press control plus O, control O and it will do this quest for me to disable it you just have to toggle it again there we go and then we can also eat automatically by putting a food item there as you can see we are almost about to finish the quest and it automatically claims the quest and so we get a reward of 50 coins and uh, next I'm going to showcase how it automatically eats as well. As you can see once it's turned into three hunger bars gone it will automatically switch to my number three key and it will start eating the... So now let us look at the actual mob spawner and the killing method. So here is what turns it on and off. Right over here there's a cyclic fan, cyclic, and that is this one right here. And it pushes the mobs that are entity cramming into the lava back into the um, nettle, nettle flower which gives the witch a withering effect of two seconds. So let us check it out up there. So this is very simple. I apologize for the mess it creates, but it's a bunch of redstone lamps and cyclic fans with the invisible block so that we can't be seen when, well, he can't hurt us from here because there's an invisible block right here. So they fall down here and then they fall back down there. So it's pretty simple. The mob switch just turns on these fans, requires redstone, and yeah. And the way we picked up these witch spawners is with the cyclic magic empty sack of holding item. So we found these in dungeons around the world. And we just pick it up like this and we place them down. Very simple. So how do we collect the items? Well, in the cyclic mod, there is this thing called the item collector. And then we have an item extractor and then a bunch of item pipes into this sorter, which sorts the items into either the trash void or these compacting drawers and interface. That is for the sugar, glowstone, redstone, gunpowder, bottles, inferium, dust and sticks. And then the rest goes in here, which is now full of items. So let's talk about how to run this script properly. So you're going to have to want to create a new file, like so, text document, and then name it blah. And then we're going to rename it to uh, a .ahk file, and you can do uh, file name extension so that you can see the extensions of it then we're going to edit this script and then we're just going to copy and paste the script from the youtube description and now we have it and you can tweak these sleep i'll leave uh, the ahk wiki below but honestly when i was doing this and coding this i mainly used google into uh getting to know the syntax and all so we have the position of the quest right here grind don't stop then we have the position of the witch which is right here then we have the position of the collect reward which is right here so it's pretty simple code and you can edit it like so so for if you have different resolution than me, you can right click 
any auto hotkey three and then hit Windows Spy, and then pan into your Minecraft, and then uh, press the chat key, and then go wherever the um, the green complete button uh, color is and then also go over your hunger bar and take note of those two coordinates that are called window I use that one and then you just want to edit that numbers over here over here over here over here and over here it's pretty simple X first and then Y and uh, yeah good luck so oh, that's it going to be for me today. Um, I hope you learned something about auto hotkey script and also how to make a efficient witch farm in Minecraft.